All right, so here we go. Hi guys and gals, uh, today is, uh, they we're gonna be doing a little streaming on, we're gonna cover Genesis console. Hey, what's up guys? Uh, I had to cover from all of the systems, that's like, I pretend to cover all of the systems, the classical systems. Of course, I need to cover Sega Genesis, which... Most of you long-time gamers know that Sega Genesis was a powerhouse. I mean, it, it kicked ass. It came out at a time where basically Nintendo was dominating the NES. And, well, you guys know the story. Everybody can read up on it. Um, just in case there's a really good book guy right here. Game over. Really awesome read. Uh, among other books, of course, that are on, on the industry, gaming industry. Uh, I have been lucky and always felt lucky of being part of that start, you know, that, that history, that rich history of gaming. Coming way from the Atari age, so... That's why I'm, I'm considering changing my, my handle or moniker, if you will. Or something by ancient or something gamer because I feel I feel really old. I feel really old, but enough of that. As you can hear in the background, um, we have Sonic the Hedgehog. Yep, this is probably one of the most popular ones that you're gonna see around for that Sega era, 16 bit. Because basically it became the mascot, for not, not only for the company, but basically it was the first real competition that uh, Mario from the Nintendo guys in you know, a competition that they actually got in terms of the mascot, in terms of popularity, Sega marketed Sonic in a way that it was almost impossible not to notice. They, you know, they portrayed this character as a, a cool alternative to Mario. Um, and one of the things that they highlighted to stress the point or to take the message and you know, bring the message to, to the masses is that they made him a fast character. Make him really speedy and really fast, you know, just like our system, just like the Genesis. Last processing. That was uh, the, the term that they market it over and over, you know. Our, our system we lack in certain areas like hey, we are faster than them. Our games are fast, our games are powerful. So the, the president, you know, the, the guy who was gonna bring that message from. So Sonic became a hit. As you can hear by the the cool music in the background, the nice graphic, colorful graphics, and speed, yes, speed was the main part of it. After playing so many Mario titles, in which you go at your own pace, it's not necessarily you go running through, uh, Sonic became the kind of gameplay where you had to move fast, 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 fast. And basically, you know, it became a hit. Became so it was something is platforming, but it was something very different from the Mario experience, from the Mario games. But don't worry, because later on, in another streaming, I'll be covering both sections for Super Nintendo as well. So don't think I'm just covering the Sega. I already did the NEC with the Turbo Graphics, but this time, you know, we gotta give it still to Sega, even though they're not around to making hardware anymore. And basically nowadays they're not making even much games. It's a pity. But that's how this business works sometimes. Reason why I'm so jaded most of the time with how things are nowadays. But enough of that. Let's give this uh Sonic the Hedgehog in. Here we go. Uh, 
very simple game for the time. I mean, compared to nowadays. But the funny thing is that even though it was a simple, in terms of mechanics, it was simple kind of a uh, simple kind of game. The difficulty, I don't know, difficulty to me in the games of the past were much, much higher. Now basically, games nowadays are basically holding your hand and giving you tutorial after tutorial. But anyway, that's just me. times that I curse out loud every time I would lose the rings by some stupid mistake. Come on, go. Go. Yeah, I got an extra life. Oh, see? See what I mean? Freaking... Uh, after all that trouble. Okay. By the way, if by any chance I'm still trying to mess around with the sound, got a little software there to manage the sound, and hopefully you guys will be able to hear me a lot more clearly, and I won't have to shout as much. So in any case, drop a line if there's something amiss. Something that's not sounding quite right, you just grab a line and I'll try to fix it on the fly. Now what was it? I can't remember the... Am I supposed to hit a button or something so he... I think I'm confusing it with the second one. Oh, there we go again. Oh, there you want. Come on, come on. Get a few more. Now, I don't want to sit down here and, and just go through this one because actually these couple of streams that I'm going to be doing is basically to highlight uh, the different classic, um, <clears throat> excuse me, classic systems, including I started way different than If I were to follow the natural order, I would have started with an eight bit. But it's going to Hmm. 
second. Okay, we're back. This is something that I gotta keep an eye on because I don't know. This is kind of weird. It's oh, what the hell? All right, go ahead and go for a shooter. I don't know for some reason, I don't know if it's the way I said uh, noise gate on the microphone, but it seems to be all wrong. I noticed on the bottom of the screen that it wasn't registering anymore. Since I have no no way for sure to tell working on it, um, it to myself, which is gonna be kinda weird because it's gonna make that echo again. So I'll, I'll keep it this way and hopefully it'll work for the best. Alright, let's get back to it. Gas hand it to me and it's the first level. Fine, give me a break here. What? Damn, down to my last life I only played like for two minutes. This is the cool thing about the shooter. The shooter uses this little pod. What it does is, with that pod, you capture the enemy's powers and you use it yourself oh, to get upgrades. But damn, jeez. We're gonna do this one. Come on. Shots or the shots or the they shoot is like blazing fast. It's, you've got almost no reaction time to oh knock, knock, knock. And I know I'm old and my reflexes are not what they used to, but damn. There you go. Oh. At least I didn't lose all the powers. I want to show you at least I get to show you how the boss and the bosses in the game like they are freaking excellent. But as my lucky skills, shooter skills are coming up right now. The fact that I'm not focusing on the game, I'm not gonna make excuses for myself. Just because I'm, the time goes on, I guess I'm stuck in the world. And that's what she said. Okay. Oh, damn. Come on. There. I should have configured, that was another thing that I kind of missed, I should have configured the controller, since I'm using a PlayStation 2 controller, I should have configured to use the analog. I should have. It was the only thing we had back then. 
the looseness of the uh, pad to this one, which is kind of stiffy and so I don't know. Again, I might be making excuses for my magic skill now. But, uh, oh, forget it. I can't. Get a, at least a out or a hundred of Jack to be able to play this properly. Go for the next one. Okay. Game music. Sound effects. Hey. Yeah. I'm gonna have to do later on some adjustments because I'm noticing since the Genesis uh, has a pretty good stereo audio, for some reason it's not picking up on the stereo effects. Something to check into later. Bueno, para aquellas personas de que no hablan español que estén viendo la transmisión. Dije que yo hablaba en ambos idiomas, pero me quedé pegado hablando en inglés. Eh, lo que están viendo aquí es uno de los juegos del sistema de Sega Genesis, de 16 bits. Prácticamente la competencia, los primeros que jugaban con... Prácticamente de a, a Nintendo. La dominación que tienen en el mercado con el Nintendo 8 bits, el Nintendo 60. Y pues fue un, un buen contendiente, tanto así que le llegó a, a robar tanto el mercado a... Pero, en el de eso... Ya... Ah, Para competir... Ahí pues salió el, el Super Nintendo, que le van a ¿Ah, pues? Y después de un tiempo, algo bien, cuando viene el sistema, se le cae. Oh, yeah. It's basically the same as uh, the other Slaughterhouse. I'm on the NEC. So let's get on. Hopefully, if
that connection. So, I gotta keep an eye on this because keep losing audio. I don't know why. But it keeps, keeps going down. I don't know if it's the noise good as not letting it come back up. But, anyways, I'm sorry for this. Uh, try to make it better next time. The same thing's running out. Keep getting better and better at like this. But for now, let's go to. I like Blaze. Blaze is badass. Beware of the rocket! Beware of the rocket! Got the jump button. Okay. What? What the hell? No, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. I am not gonna be. I'm not gonna have my ass kicked again. Sorry. Not gonna happen. Where's the punch button for this thing? Now this right here, Swiss of Rage. This is Sega's take on Final Fight, a game that I'll probably be covering in the Super NES stream. Final Fight, as many of you know, is one of the main franchises that they had back in the day, Capcom. And the arcade, that arcade was very popular. I spent a whole bunch of quarters on that one. Final Fight, and then a little later Street Fighter. It was like the, the big earners. Okay, that's enough. All this crap. What's wrong with you? All right, got some food. So basically, since Final Fight was such a hit, Sega made their own type of Final Fight game called. It's a rage, the one that I'm playing with now. I'm trying to remember the name of the musical composer. I don't know if it was it was. Uh, no, I'm not even gonna try to remember it because it was a famous composer, Japanese composer, that wrote this music, and for the time that blew a lot of people's minds. Because it might seem tiny, it was a tiny sound now, but back in the day, ooh. Those beats was pretty awesome, considering, especially considering the Genesis that really didn't have that really good of a sound hardware. And I can't complain about the graphics either. I mean, for the time, these graphics compared to the rest of the games were really, really nice. I'm trying to remember, I know they have special moves. What the hell? But I can't I can't remember how to activate them. What was it? What was it? No, get away. Hey food. Food. Give me food. I want food. Alright. Get over here. Smack. Oh yeah. Smack. Smack. Yeah. So one of those time wasters. doing that bad. So I get to fight the boss. Get over here. Trying to whip me with that shit. Oh well.
So as you can see, these type of games are not meant to be really complicated, really elaborate, like, let's say, role-playing games, but they were fun. Gotta figure out the patterns, like this guy right here, which, which I know if he catches me with that thing, he's gonna mess me up really good. And there you go. Check my weapon, you dumbass. You wanna take my weapon? Throw it from me. Trying to get all touchy feely. What's wrong with you? Hey, wait! I wish I had a way to incorporate a little liquor. That would be really cool. Make me really relax. But... Ah. Third world problems. Oh. Come on. No, 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 no. There you go. You dead? I think you are. I got a chance to kick its ass. <laughs> what do you mean, Afro So? What happened? for a second here. Oh yeah. <laughs> Actually hope so. <laughs> that would be really nice. Well, I'm go ahead and more importantly, am I sounding right? Because at least you're the first input I'm getting. So let me know how the sound is doing. If I'm registering, if I'm too loud, too low. Let's let me know. Okay. Next up. I... So many games that I had in mind. Yes. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Ah, now we're talking. I'm going to start getting into the ones that I like. Of course, Ghouls and Ghosts must be there, but I have to just one. has been in the news a lot. The whole Kojima scandal and all that crap. And it's a shame because back in back in the day, around this time, Konami was man, they, they were the shit. Them, Capcom and a whole bunch of others. Now this treasure was known for taking Hardware. It, do, it didn't matter if it was strong or not, but they would take hardware and take it to the next level. I mean, they would they would take any kind of hardware and just bring out effects, graphical effects, music, and stuff that no other company could do. At least in my opinion. So, yeah, this is one of those games. And don't let the cartoony nature of it um, fool you. Treasure games are extremely hard. And if I can remember... Why am I getting only two inputs here? I don't know, there's one button that I'm not using here. But anyways, okay. Get a mixture of run and shoot, kind of like Contra. 
and at the same time you get close for the combat. Hey. Uh, one of the things that made this game really special is the fact that they could cram all of these sprites on the screen and not have the system bogged down. Get off of me! Please. That's what I'm talking about. Hear me? Alright. See what I'm saying? I mean, there's tons of sprite sprites at the same time, and considering the hardware and the Genesis, I mean, it's doing a lot. Plus the stereo sound, you know, treasure, they know their stuff. I really don't know what happened to them. I'm hoping they're in some capacity they're still around making games. Surely hope so. Gotta look into that. Yo, get off of me! Get off of me! How do you change? There you go. Get off of me! Nah, I got the homemade shots now. And I'm almost dead. Okay. Look at this. Look at this right here. It might not seem as much, but those effects, those were never seen in the system, not like that. That kind of warping effects, these guys know their stuff. And there goes the first boss. Alright, yeah, give me power-ups. Ah. Oh, I'm almost dead. Oh. All right, there we go. No, 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 no. Come on, give me a heart. Give me a heart. Give me something. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Dead. Oh, I would keep on going, to be honest, because I love that game. But, no. Let's just... I've had it for another one. How about we go now for... What was this? Uh, I don't remember. Oh, wait. Hold on a second. Well, basically Final Fantasy... Ooh, I'll probably start covering that with the uh, next one. With, uh,
Give me at least a minute. Okay, I'm back again. Having issues still with the microphone. Okay, now we go back. As I was saying, uh, guys, give me a minute. Back. I don't know for how long. 
Okay. I gotta figure out what's going on with this. Been a real pain in the butt. But for some reason it's randomly turning off the sound and there's not much I can do about that, so... At least for now. Uh, but let me stay on course until this starts acting up again. This is another one. There we go. This one is a pretty, pretty old arcade game. I think this came out even before Golden Axe, if I'm not mistaken. And there I spent my special power or whatever. Give me my energy. Go over here. What? I'm trying to bite off my head. Get out of here. Die, you bastard. Okay. Getting my ass kicked again. Oh crap. No, oh, no, oh, no. Oh. Got no energy. Screw! I have no way to fight him. Find another one. Okay. Afterburner, I'm not gonna cover because that one was covered to death before. Battle Toads, if I put that one on, I'm going to be cursing all the way through. So. Equals from uh, Blaster Master. Presented by Data East. All right. Let's get to it.
They got two again. This one has a mix of kind of like Bionic Commando kind of thing going for it. Power up, look at all those power ups. Oh, yes. Now, I don't know if I'm confusing this one with um, Super Turrican from Super NES, because that's the one I remember the most. <clears throat> and that one I think you can shoot in all directions. This one I think is limited. In that sense. You can shoot this way. Grappling hook. No! Oh. Wasted that. Oh! Button placement of this is terrible. Wait, that's the way it's supposed to go. Teethered. It's another platform. Okay, let's go to the next one. Gotta keep covering these quick because I don't know how long. Is gonna start acting up again. I'm even afraid to move from here. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, no, no. This. This is a good one. Super popular in the arcade. I am not hearing my name. Hmm, that's weird. Okay, there we go. And Strider Ryu. Jump, jump! For some reason, I'm not getting, I'm not getting the music. Yeah, I know the. Hold on a second. Let me. I'm sorry, I have to do this, but. I need to cut in real quick here and see what, what the hell is going on, because I'm supposed to have stereo sound, and I'm only grabbing, like, the sound effects and not the music. 
to check into that later also. Oh the music is not oh okay. So it's probably I'm not I'm not I'm not receiving it over here. That's probably the thing. I probably disconnected something from my my panel and that's why I'm not getting any any of that sound. One here I don't know. I'll check it out later. I'm, I'm sorry to make that stop there. Thanks Afro Soul for the input. Really helpful. No. Ah, there goes Strider. I cannot move an inch from here without having this crap out, so I'm going to be very careful, select my last game, and be quick about it. Uh -huh, bye. Oh wait, I got, okay, assuming that it works. This, I think, it was one that you requested from me. Excuse me. This the one you were talking about? Fishy. By the way, how are the dogs sounding? <laughs> this, by the way, is Wonder Boy and Monster Land. It's kind of like that Zelda's vibe to it. Monster World series also was a very popular game, more more in Japan than over here in the States, but I guess I, oh, I want to give me the leather shoes. And I don't have any money for the shoes. Crap. I don't have any money. How am I gonna buy it? If this is the one that you were asking me the other day, because it is Wonder Boy, but I don't think it's, it's probably the Wonder Boy that you were asking about. There's different kinds. Yeah, this is gonna be a little bit more slow paced type of game, so I'm gonna go. 
next one. Even though this game came out for the SNES, this was one of those cases where the actual version was actually better. The graphics are pretty similar. I mean, the gameplay is basically the same thing. Sound? I don't know. The music on this one sounds a little bit like this. It's really more, it's really more clear. And, I don't know. It, it looks more sharp on this one, on this version. We got a nice little doggy down there. Alright, here we go. Look at that. Look at that. Whoa. 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 Ah, see? It was the original Wonder Boy. Well, the original Wonder Boy, I probably have it for the Sega Master System, which was the system that came before Genesis. Here we go. Oh, wait. I was supposed to shoot that thing so I can launch the cow. Come on. There you go. Cow launch. To the other side. No, oh, wanna reach that platform. Gotta time the jumps. There you go. Get away from me, doggy. There you go. Oh, I missed the other one. Okay. Go to the next part. Now this game was made by a company back in the day called Shiny Entertainment, which they went on to create very popular games um, known for their animation. The animator, I don't know if his name was Steve Perry or something like that. I think he went on to work, I think it was in THQ before they, they, they went bankrupt, I'm not sure. And as you can tell, I mean, the man knew how to work the animations on the, on the characters, I mean, look at this. But to be a sprite, with all the animations going on, and he was the uh, one responsible for um, licensed games like Lion King and uh, the other one, Tarzan, uh, Adam. All games were by Sean. I want to get that power. How do I get that power? There has to be a way to jump up there. Again, freaking throw that away. This game was really cool in the sense that it had a lot of nooks and crannies, a lot of hidden stuff. I mean, most of the games back in the day were like that. You can play the game several times, and every time you would go back to it, you would find something new. 
instead of uh, uh, instead of getting it through a D <coughs> DLC. There's the jump button. Jump! Jump! Damn it. Yeah, I can't. On. Quarry. Get on. Continue. Checkpoint. And I went exactly to the same point. Leave that crap. God. Oh, leave me alone, damn fuck. Oh, get away from me. And that's it. That's it, I'm fed up. That's a nice guy. Hey, 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 what you doing? I slap that. There you go. Get off of me! What the hell? Get off of me. Oh crap the dog And that's that Oh guys I'll be back for the second part I was gonna make a whole stream but I'm gonna cut it right here uh, for now, so I can take a 5 10 minute break and then I'll be right back. Hope to see you guys in a little while. Bye bye.